you know what? You can tell it's the morning because I went to do my introduction and halfway through during my introduction, I realized I wasn't recording. So good morning, everyone. Uh, yes, hello, everyone. Leap Caddison here. We are doing Avengers. We are doing the uh, uh, official A-Day trailer uh, that dropped during E3, uh, the Square Enix panel um, during the silly hours of the morning, uh, which I was not going to stay up for just for one trailer because um, I think that's the only thing I'm really, really interested in. I'm not really an Assassin's Creed person. I'm not really a Kingdom of Hearts person or whatever. Um, and I've been really, really hyped for this because we were promised we were getting new information because last year we didn't get squat about Avengers uh, compared to the year before where we were teased, oh, we're getting an, an Avengers game. Um, so we are having this trailer this year uh, as a teaser for things to come. And hopefully uh, it turns out to be a really, really great game because I believe, well, I think this game is separate from the movies. Um, if anything, it might be connected to the PS4 Spider-Man game, which uh, is its own entity itself. Uh, because I know there's been a lot of people hoping that it does connect and all of that. Um, even though Avengers Tower was in the PS4 game, the Avengers were nowhere to be seen. So maybe this might explain some things. Who knows? Um, I mean, we'd have to probably wait until the full game comes out or whatever. But um, yeah, I mean, there's a lot of people hoping because I think a lot of people are hoping for uh, a Marvel game verse. Uh, and the PS4 Spider-Man was really, really superb. Uh, even I think like it's one of the best entities of Spider-Man to exist. And um I am hoping that it can branch off to um, some new entities like Avengers. Uh, like I'm hoping this does connect and all of that because I think that I think a game verse would be really really good, especially if this game is like the PS4 Spider Man and it's really really super. So um, yeah, but um, yeah. With that said, let's just delve right into this reaction. This is the Avengers A Day official trailer. Let's go. In game footage, ooh. You know that old saying, never meet your heroes? It can come true, can't it? Well, Gulp. I did. Oh, right. Avengers Day, it yay! was awesome. The Avengers oh, damn. were everything I imagined. Hello, Lordy! <laughs> I love this! Ah, uh, someone has to be a party pooper. Thor, Tony, check it out. At once. Try to keep up. Oh, that's brilliant! <laughs> this just got a whole lot more interesting. <laughs> I'm so stoked to be playing as Thor and uh, Tony. Better landing than in full Ragnarok. Quick. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get into the city. Are you set them up? File, knock them down. Everybody, Thor, this is good. There are humans trapped. And lots of small, angry men with guns. Is that a joke? Did Thor make a joke? <laughs> <laughs> that Travis um, playing for? Nice. Oh. Ah, shit. Tony, Thor, the cables. Cap, We're just getting absolutely knackered. Start the chimera. What's your status? We should head back. Brilliant. No, stay on task. There are still civilians on this bridge. I'm, I'm wondering if this is Hydra. No. Ah, shoot. Some say they were set up. Others. This would be Hydra's MO. Do the Avengers pose a danger to society? That was the question, Bruce. That was the question. Well, 
we all lost something that day. No! That's not how this story ends. No, no, no! Oh, shit! This looks good. What are we waiting for? Ooh. Thanos. Thanos. No, it's not. Um, okay, so... Cap is dead. Great. Holy shit. And... It's the, like, original kind of lineup from the, like, from the MCU movies, except one thing. We forgot about it. It's it's Infinity War all over again. We forgot about Hawkeye uh, because I noticed. Oh, it's like the original uh, Avengers for the MCU. They are pulling um, bits from the movies. It seems like uh, they get up. It uh, does have that reminiscence of um, uh, the Avengers. Hulk is fighting. Uh, fighting. I think it's Abomination. I think uh, it is. Um, like he did in the first movie. Um, yeah, and uh, there's this discussion on um, the safety of the Avengers. Like, um, do we have? Uh, should we have faith in them? Because, uh, or are they really putting a fracture in our society? Um, it's it's giving me some kind of Civil War vibes. But um, yeah, um, I really enjoyed that trailer. Um, I'm wonder I don't know if we're gonna like um see more characters throughout this because uh, that would be really really awesome because it's uh it wouldn't just be these guys would it like as the Avengers um throughout um like it, it, this incarnation um I'm sure they would develop from it and I would love to see more characters and I would love to know what the hell happened to Hawkeye uh he's probably with family before Thanos yeah so yeah um I'm just gonna glance through the trailer itself just to uh pick out some interesting uh screen bits or stuff that i've missed and all of that uh four suit looks pretty pretty uh uh great um i don't know i i think it looks pretty alien which is really really good um avengers day um yeah, Tony, you don't expect anything else it looks really really awesome uh cap's got a more like um uh, i don't know it, it, it's like he's more armored up, which is really, really neat. Um, so, uh, yeah. And he also looks to be getting on quite a bit. He's not like um, the Chris Evans version, like a uh, young spring chicken and all of that. But like I said, these characters, if Spider-Man's been around for like, what, eight years? But, uh, who knows? Maybe this takes place during, um, like, before... Um, Spider-Man PS4. You never know. Um, so uh, these could be a few years banded together and all of that. Um, but uh, but then again, if this is connected, then I'm sure Spider-Man would have said something. Like, uh, um, he made these comments like, oh, the Avengers are never around. Um, so maybe they are never around because they were so busy in San Francisco or whatnot because uh, we saw the bridge collapse. Uh, and um, Spider-Man took place in New York, so uh, maybe that's why. Hmm. Uh, I don't know. I would want this. I, I, I wouldn't mind if this um, was connected. I, in fact, I encourage it so much. Um, but yeah, um, it, uh, it started off rosy, Avengers Day. Yay. Tony uh, pulling off the fireworks as usual. You're breathtaking. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to. Um, and then all hell breaks loose, uh, probably with Hydra. I love this um, shot where all the Avengers are lined up and you get a proper look at all of them. Um, yeah. Tony looks more... I don't know. You'd expect... Oh, Robert Downey Jr. and all of that. But I don't know. He's kind of reminding me from... Uh, you know, the animations, uh, like the Spider-Man animated series and all of that. He kind of reminds... He's kind of reminiscent of that. And not like a Robert Downey Jr. Uh, lookalike and all of that. You, you, I think he, that's the notion going through a lot of people's heads now. That, uh, like, Tony Stark is Robert Downey Jr. Uh, vice versa. Especially with what Robert's just announced. Um, so, yeah. But, um, yeah, we got a good proper look at all the Avengers, which looks pretty, pretty rad, to be fair. Um, 
don't mind me, I'm just um, seeing if I'm recording and all of that. Um, so yeah. Uh, third person perspective as four and Iron Man rush to the bridge. Um, and, and like I said, all hell breaks loose. And like I said, better version than Ragnarok um, for Hulk. Uh, at least he's not like... There we go. So, uh, yeah. Uh, oh, my God. I can't wait to play this. I am honestly so stoked to just be controlling Iron Man. And, uh, yeah. Uh, uh, no, I. it's not just that. I think it's the idea that you're going to be playing a bunch of characters like Hulk, uh, Black Widow, maybe more, hopefully. Uh, I, would, I would love to see, because we know the Avengers are not just, like, these guys. Um... There will be more added to the mix. Heck, the MCU will have a new branch of Avengers following Endgame, won't they? Um, well, Spider-Man was an official Avenger, basically an Infinity War. So, yeah, I would love to, to like, see a universe of more heroes and all of that. Um, yeah, I, I think these guys might be Hydra. Who knows? Um, do we get a look-see? Oh, they've got, like, skull masks on, so... Yeah, um, we get to see four just with Nulia. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Like, I'm just imagining just playing as four right now. Um, just, um, wielding Nulia. And, uh, just because we saw Cap get, uh, use his shield and all of that. And, and just the idea is just so appealing. It's so attractive. So, I'm really, really stoked to be playing this. Um, I mean, the gameplay might be clunky, but it's just the idea. I'm, like, we don't know what the controls could be like. It could be clunky. It could be, like, uh, terrible gameplay-wise. But it just looks so appealing, uh, like Hulk smashing that tag right there. It just looks really, really stellar. And rip that guy. <laughs> he just landed head first and, uh, oh, he got yeet. So, um, and then that guy was just lucky. He just got out the way before he became minced meat. Um, uh, more brutish version of the soldiers, it seems. So, um, judging by how, like, ripped he is. Um, so, yeah. And then, there we go. San Francisco. Yeah. Um, so, I re so, I'm assuming this is, like, the first mission. Um, like, their failure. To, um, oh, this is what I'm talking about. You, you just using the cap to take down potentially Hydra. Uh, using the uh, shield, should I say. It just looks really, really good stuff. Um, but, um, yeah, I'm assuming this is all taking place within, like, the first whatever of the game. Um, because it does set things up for when Cap dies, for when the Avengers seem to be disbanded. Um, oh, yeah, you do get to see a bit of Black Widow. Uh, Widow. So, I like that. You get to see all of the current incarnation. Uh, because Hawkeye... We need him. We need him. Um, it all goes back to that um, talk, though, doesn't it? Whenever Hawkeye is there with the Avengers, they win. Whenever he isn't, and Hawkeye wasn't here, people, so here we go again. Um, oh, is that Taskmaster? Uh, Master? I think that was Taskmaster. Yeah, it is. It looks like it. The uh, Okay. So I would, ooh, okay. So, because he was in the PS4 game with Spider-Man... Is he, like, I'm trying to see if he's, like, um, it's hard to say, but, um, he does, ooh, this is good, this is juicy, this is juicy, because I think he did say that he has fought with the Avengers before in the Spider-Man game, I'm not too sure, but, like, um, Spider-Man, uh, compared to these guys, um, depending where this fits time-wise as well, um, these guys would be bigger fish, surely. So, yeah. Um, and uh, this is where everyone realizes they were defeated and all of that. I, I, I think it is. So, yeah. Got to say, the face animation looks pretty, pretty decent as well. Um, so, I really, really like that. It looks... Um, um, yeah, it looks solid. And then we uh, then we see the time passage basically happen. You could tell... I Well, it could, it could be a few months and all of that, but... Um, it's, it seems to suggest longer, uh, potentially. Uh, they, like I said, there seems to be that fracture. Tony say, uh, Tony saying that people have faith in us. And uh, now that's gone. And that's depressing to see. Um, just, uh, like, oh, I can't wait to play as Captain America in this game. 
No, I don't think I will. <laughs> uh, any any excuse to use that meme. And then uh, it's been on, yeah, Rising. So that's uh, pretty, pretty rad as the Avengers get back together. Um, to stop what I'm assuming is an even bigger threat and whatnot. Uh, because something was rising out of the ground. And then you see non-Hydra affiliated characters. Like uh, Abomination. I think it's Abomination. I can't remember the name. Uh, but uh, it, it is definitely the same uh, guy that Hulk faced in the first movie. So yeah. And uh, like I said, we see uh, the four. Um, the Fantastic Four. Face off against something even bigger. Whoever that could be. Ooh, do we get... Like, do we get a detail? Like... Hmm. I mean, you can't really tell much, can you? Because, like, it's just... Like... Yeah, but... I don't know uh, if that is a bit of purple or whatnot. I mean, it could be the colour texture and all of that, but... I don't know. Something rising. I don't know who... I'm not trying to suggest it's Thanos. Maybe Galactus or something like that. Because uh, I'm assuming we're going to have an Avengers level uh, threat kind of character in the final fight. In this final fight. Who knows. Um, but uh, we'll just have to wait and see. But yeah, the trailer looks really, really solid. I absolutely uh, am stoked to play this. Animation, uh, like the character designs look pretty, pretty decent. Um, I like the look of all the Avengers. And I, lo I like the idea that like, some characters like Cap are more like um, modded up in terms of like their body armor. They are more like uh, protected and all of that. So yeah, but... Um, yeah, it looks pretty, pretty great. And I love the premise be uh, behind the story, especially uh, San Francisco's fall and how that separates the Avengers and how Cap uh, becomes a casualty. So, um, yeah, I am really, really excited to see um, what does happen in this game because this game does look absolutely um brilliant so yeah I, i'm really looking forward to seeing um i've just realized as well like if it, like infinity war we had a bit of a time skip and then hawkeye does return and then well have hawkeye return here because the hawkeye is nowhere to be seen it's infinity war all over again so yeah and, and like i said Whenever Hawkeye is with the Avengers, they succeed. Whenever he isn't, yeah, nothing good happens. And like evidence, San Francisco Falls, where's Hawkeye? Exactly. So um, I think Hawkeye is like, people always rag about Hawkeye. Well, he's just a guy with a bow and arrow, but he is actually the core of the Avengers. He is able, he is, is, if anything, he his power is luck. He gives the Avengers good luck, if anything. So yeah, uh, that's the one hidden uh, power uh, for Hawkeye. Um, but uh, no, in all seriousness, this, this game does look pretty, pretty decent. I, I'm not going to lie. It looks pretty sick. Like I said, the premise behind uh, the story looks very, very intriguing. And I can't wait to see, like, um, what does happen throughout this game. It looks pretty, pretty promising. I just, l I don't, like I said, I do geek out about the idea you're playing as Iron Man, you're playing as Captain America. I mean, you, you could do in... Uh, the licensed MCU games because we had Iron Man have his game out. Uh, I think Captain uh, America had uh, a game out for him. Thor did. Uh, but none of them were well received, I believe. Um, I know games after uh, based on the movie doesn't really do well. Um, and I think that MCU is no exception, but um, hopefully these, uh, like I said, hopefully, like looking at them, they look really, really good. Like the gameplay uh, in this game, it could be clunky. Uh, some people might say, well, playing as these characters look really, really, uh, really, really clunky and all of that. But um, hopefully that's not the case. Hopefully it's like Spider-Man, it's fluid. It's got like the best mechanics uh, you can imagine, uh, because Spider-Man PS4 has the best mechanics for me, and uh, that's always very, very pivotal. Um, like, it could be super, super clunky 
uh, it could make no sense. Like, um, oh, Spider-Man swinging on air again. Um, whereas Insomniac managed to fix that, which is really, really decent. Um, so hopefully Square Enix takes a page from their book and manages to capitalize on the mechanics because I would, because honestly, I would love a, a good Avengers game. And this does look pretty, pretty good story-wise, gameplay-wise. It does look promising, but again you have to uh, have a feel for it so uh, but it does look pretty pretty sick um, as we went through all the avengers so yeah but yeah yeah this was the avengers uh, a day official trailer uh, i really really like the look of this and it looks very very promising not gonna lie so yeah i will see you guys next time hope you guys enjoyed this reaction you can check my videos on the right if you want to check out more of my content you can also subscribe to my media feed channel if you want to hope you guys enjoyed this reaction hope you guys take care and i will see you guys next time toodles